the systems we're looking at at the moment, we have, uh, we have HPCX, that's about a 15 teraflop system, so that can do uh, 15 uh, million million calculations uh, in a second. It has about two and a half thousand processors in it. We're looking uh, through um, developments uh, within the lab to get something near a petaflop scale system. And even now we're working at the international level to think through what would an exascale system look like. So this is something that can do 10 to the power of 18 additions and multiplications every second. It will have millions and millions of processors. And if we're going to exploit these systems in five to six years time, we've got to start developing the applications and thinking through what science it is we want to solve, how we're going to solve it on these very specific architectures. Now, developing software um, is not, you know, it's not something you can do on a Saturday afternoon if you're going to be sort of world class on your own. And this is why, this is the driver behind the Hartree Centre, bringing together a critical mass of people with skills in different areas of computational science who understand high performance and parallel computing. And we, we bring together the leading academics into these groups to say, you know, what are, what are the challenges, say, in computational engineering? So major themes in terms of energy, in terms of dealing with, uh, with an ageing population, uh, with security, uh, and with uh, dealing with climate change, the uh, major societal challenges. And the, the impetus really is, is for the science base to demonstrate that it is having an impact in those areas. In terms of investment at Darsby, uh, it's uh, £50 million capital so this is for a building and uh, state-of-the-art computer systems on the Hartree Centre and there'll be £15 million invested in the Detector System Centre. That's great, but you need resources to exploit the capital, so what we're intending to do is ramp up our activities here from uh, a sort of an annual budget of about £8 million to £20 million and that's with investments from STFC and then going out and generating new business opportunities, new uh, research projects. So we imagine, well, we're planning on a, a sustainable activity of about 200 staff uh, within the Hartree Centre, structured around grand challenge projects. So imagining we'll have a, of order uh, 10 to 12 grand challenge projects active at any point in time uh, with about 10 people in each project and that will be a mixture of our staff, um, industrial, commercial staff and uh, university staff actually working on, on uh, integrated projects.